Hello Voyager team! I hope you're all doing well! In this video, we are working in our I Spy 3 course book. We are starting or beginning Unit 4 on page 26. We will begin the first lesson, which is with our classic little three vignettes so that you must choose A, B, or C. On listening to the vignettes, you decide which story. So these are our, our friends, and you must listen. Then we will listen to a little rhyme, and this rhyme is a, a rhyme which helps you learn how to use the negative in English. And to make a sentence or a thought, a sentence negative, in English, you need to use do not. For example, I like chocolate. I do not like chocolate. So, I do not can be contracted down to don't. I don't like chocolate, which is false. I love chocolate. This is how we know the negative. Don't is the negative in English. They do this little rhyme by giving you orders or commands such as stand up, sit down, touch your nose, touch the table, turn around, raise your hand. So they'll give you one command such as stand up, don't sit down, touch your nose, don't touch your head. Walk. Don't run. This is how we do it in English, okay? So this is a little practice, and this is the beginning of how to learn to do negation in English. Okay, we've had it before. This is review again with more commands, okay? Then you have our work in our activity book. When you're done with listening to the listening part, our activity book is the one with no color and you go to page 22 and you have code spy language and you have to write these words out which is bread and then once you know what letter goes with what number you can write out the code of each spy so it's like Morse code that spies can use but it's slightly different, so you need to write it out, okay? When you're done, send me a photograph that I can see if you understood what you were doing. And do not hesitate to contact me on WhatsApp so I know that you're okay, all right? Okay, now let's listen. We're going to listen to our silly little stories at the top. We know we like those, and you have to tell me which one is the first one? Is it the C or the A or the B? Which one is it? Just so let me get it set up for you. Listening number Ooh. 65. Oh, listen listen and choose. Listen and choose. Oh, what a lovely waterfall. Mm. Hey, this is great. Waterfall. Now it's time to eat my picnic. Oh, picnic. oh no, my lunch. Which one was it? A, B, or C? Let's go in the cave. Oh, go in the cave? Wow, this is great. Now time for our picnic. Oh, no, bats! Help! <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like Scooby Doo. Which one? A, B, or C? Ah, oh, up the mountain. That's nice oh, to climb the mountain. This is great. Beautiful view. Now, I think it's time for my picnic. <laughs> oh no! Help! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> So maybe the billy goat did not want her to have a picnic there. 
Okay, so very simple. You need to tell me which one you heard first, which one is second, which one third. Okay, listening activity and trying to figure out the context of the story that you listen to, the little vignette. If they're talking about waterfalls, hmm. If they're talking about caves, if they're talking about mountains, what do you think we're going to start talking about in this particular unit? Hmm. Okay, now let's listen to the bottom. And it's the little rhyme. You need to first just listen. The second time you will listen and repeat. Okay? Okay, let's go. Here we go. Listening number 66. Okay. Part A. Listen and do. Stand up. Don't sit down. Touch your head and turn around. Point to the window. Point to the door. Sit on the chair. Don't sit on the floor. Pick up your pencils. Don't pick up your pen. Count to three. Don't count to ten. One, two, three. Now say it again. <laughs> it's very cute. It sounds like an American... Um, I don't so uh, I would say a uh, typical uh, cowboy song. <laughs> okay, so you need to listen a little bit fast, but try, try to do what it tells you to do, and don't do what it tells you to not to do. Here we go again. Listening listen number again. sixty-six, okay. part B. Listen, repeat, and do. Oh, even repeat and do. Stand up. Stand up. Don't touch your head. Don't touch your head. Point to the chair. Point to the chair. Don't point to the window. Don't point to the window. Pick up your pen. Pick up your pen. Turn around. Turn around. Sit down. Sit down. Listening number 67. Oops. There we go. Okay. Now, these are simple orders such as sit down, pick up your pen. Or, if we don't want you to do it, it's negative. You say, don't sit down, don't pick up your pen. Okay. Now, I'm going to reread the little rhyme. I would like you guys to practice this rhyme and be able to tell me it either on Zoom or on WhatsApp on your own. Okay. Try to do it fairly quickly like you heard these guys do. Okay. It's, it's, it's cute. I think it's cute. So, stand up, don't sit down, touch your head and turn around. Point to the window, point to the door, sit on the chair, don't sit on the floor. Pick up your pencil, don't pick up your pen. Count to three, don't count to ten. One, two, three, now say it again. Now, I don't do it like some sort of cowboy singing, <laughs> folk dancing, but here we go. Try it once more with the music, okay? Listening number 66. Part A. Listen and do. Listen and do. It's fun. Stand up. Don't sit down. Touch your head and turn around. Okay, good luck on being as fast as they are. <laughs> okay, then do make sure you do this page and uh, let me see what work you've done. Okay, bye bye guys.